Welcome to Proceeding Onward in America. Hi, I'm Fabian, and as you notice, Becky's not here to join me today, because according to the last vlog we posted, she has left. She went to go teach on an academy ship over in California, California Maritime Academy, and they went through the Panama Canal. First, they stopped there to grab some fuel. Um, went through the Panama Canal, and after that, they went to the Bahamas, where they had a little accident with a crane. Everybody's okay, just a little minor damage. And then after that, to Portugal, and now they're off on a Portugal island called Azores. Don't know if I'm pronouncing it right. Azores. Hey guys, it's Becky real quick. I just want to let you know it's called the Azores. Baby, and you're close. Love you, babe. And after that, she'll be headed over to Florida and then to Texas before she comes back home. So she'll be back in about another month. So for the past month, I've been living in Woody all by myself. I bet y'all all been wondering how am I managing without Becky. It's not bad. I do miss her. I miss her a lot. We text on Facebook Messenger almost every day and she sends me pictures of everything she's doing, um, things that she's seeing and she's having fun out there and that's great and I'm so happy for her. It's definitely what she likes to do which is teach and she likes shipping so she loves this type of job. I'm also a marine maritime as well so yes I do ship um, often here and there. did come across one where I'm gonna go and repair one in New Orleans and after the repair work we're gonna deliver it to Miami so that's pretty much what I'm getting ready for. Being that we don't really have a steady income and we're full-time RVing traveling across the world there are times like this where we gotta stop and make some money um, right now I need to go fill up the water tank because that's how I've been basically using my water supplies all right let's go now this is our water bucket so what I've been doing to get my water supply so I can cook drink water and drink my coffee as I come to the house and I use their water pipe to fill up and then once I'm filled I carry this seven gallon jug back to the RV and fill it up Now I know some of y'all probably have done the same thing before as well, but this is pretty much the easy point. 